Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to, uh, well, Lucky Corners in Workers and Resources, Soviet Republic. Right. Okay, so last time around, I messed around with uh, changing the plumbing situation. Uh, I got a water well uh, scheduled down here, and I've got a water sewage out outflow scheduled down here. It's winter. Uh, I've got a bunch of electric infrastructure being built to go down there. Probably overbuilt, of course. And this guy is just about done. So that will that will get uh, progress uh, going on here. Uh, so once that's done, then... Uh, this should get done pretty quickly because uh, it won't be soaking up slow um, uh, labor, right? Um, right. Also, once winter's done, things will go a little bit faster. Uh, that's, that's just the way things are. Uh, winter slows things down. Go figure. Um, yeah. Uh, and here we go. More, uh, more victims and the progress uh, and you can see here this the electric infrastructure it's working its way down the list getting some stuff uh, done there most of that stuff is probably not going to take that long to build uh, it will the pipes especially will burn through resources uh, that's fine uh, if we observe up here we have uh, uh, we have uh, 32k 32 and a half k exports right so uh that's uh, definitely covering off our uh, main expenses for a while right uh so it's not likely going to be uh too big of a an issue uh, now taking a look down here related vehicles uh on, headed toward the building We've got a bus yeah oh look it's an excavator and it's a cement truck yeah and steel yep stuff is happening yes okay uh once i get all of this infrastructure business uh sorted out i think i'll probably uh, probably start building the houses right uh, you know because that seems like it would be useful um now i could build this uh gravel road all the what all the way down to here yeah, that seems like it might be a decent thing to do, actually. Wait, what? No, go over here. Uh, click that. Yep, okay. Uh, assign it without the... Yeah, do mechanisms only. Build that, that road all the way down there. Yeah. Okay. Well, that will, at the very least, get a little bit more uh, rapid traffic down that way. Because it won't have to go over this way, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, more alternative routes. That's always a good thing, isn't it? Uh, don't care about that. Um, where are you? You're coming down the road. Ah. Well, uh, whoops. Don't scroll the thing when you don't mean to. Yes, I know. That's uh, kind of, uh, kind of goes without saying, doesn't it? Okay, we need 17 more work days. I mean, that's going to take a minute. Uh, we got a month left on winter. Yeah. Right. We got another bus load coming. Right. That might be enough to sort it out just about. Might need a third bus load. Yeah, might. Yeah, apparently it takes forever to build a monument. I mean, I don't know if you've ever observed a large monument being built in real life. Uh, those do take a while. Uh, they take longer than you think they should. Um, I mean, the plug ring in the city, uh, in my, my city, um, it's just a big blue ring with a light on the top, right? It took them bloody forever to put that thing up. Uh, 
they also spent way more than it they really should have on something that dumb but yeah whatever it's there um it's not called the plug ring by the way uh it just sticks up there like like a ring you might have on a plug you know for pulling it out of the uh the drain right but yeah it's it's just it it's it's a thing right uh uh, I just got, I, I was struck with the notion that it looked like a plug ring right when they built it. And I'm like, what's that? And then, uh, you know, I've actually looked at it close up and went, huh, it's a big steel ring that's painted blue. I mean, <laughs> whatever, right? Um, I, you know, I kind of think, I, I think I kind of like the rubble pile on the other side of the city better. Uh, it, it's a stack of rocks, actually, uh, but it, it's not a rubble pile, really. It is some sort of art, um, but it kind of looks like a rubble, right? Um, there, there's something more to it, right, than that. I mean, there, there's actually a, a sculpture that's obviously art in a nearby mall that uh, is literally garbage in a resin. Or something like that. So that one is clearly uh, that one's more clearly art than the rubble pile. Um, might just be because you can get closer to it. I don't know. Uh, hard to say. Uh, right now that I finished doxing myself, there um, we have the Red Star Monument. Right. Okay. Now other stuff can uh, can start making some sort of progress on something. Uh, yeah. Okay, stuff is... Oh, the water well. Oh, an excavator went there. Okay. I don't think the small water well needs, um, uh, needs, uh, workers. Which is why I went with a small one. I think the large one does. Uh, so that was an important factor. Yeah. Oh, we're going to need water for making uh, concrete at the uh, concrete plant that I plumbed and uh, plumbed in. I haven't actually plumbed it yet uh, further up uh, the, the map. Uh, and that I can do with just a water well right beside it, right? So, yeah. And then the potable water will come from the water grid, right? Uh, oh, that's just, that's waiting now for uh, resources. Yeah, okay. Well... Stuff is uh, getting done. I think I want these two to be prioritized, though. Yeah, yeah, I think I do want them prioritized. Now, okay, that one has a bunch of buses coming. Okay, that should get sorted out pretty quick. Right? Uh, yeah, it just needs 171 work days. So yeah, it should get sorted out pretty quick when, uh, with two cranes and, and, uh, uh, you know, a dozen workers, it should get, should get sorted out fairly quick. Uh, once this is sorted out, uh, and this guy, again, with the workers gets sorted out, I will, uh, I will get a distribution operation going and, uh, uh, get uh, deliveries coming in there. Now I'm going to need covered hulls uh, for food and uh, electronics and uh, clothes. And I'm going to need a refrigeration truck for um, for the uh, meat. Yeah. Okay. So that is... Well, okay, that's definitely going up uh, 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 faster. Right. Okay. So just watch it here and see how that comes along. Uh, the important part here is it gets built, right? Ah, we need more, more workers delivered. Drat. Uh, I was hoping it'd finish on that batch, but no, it didn't. Now we're also, it's going to take a while to build these uh, pipes as well. Uh, I'm not overly concerned about that part of it. I think the, 
uh, the whatchamacallit uh, will uh, be able to keep up with that, with the needs in this immediate area for a little bit. Uh, technical services, that's what it's called. Uh, the technical services. Right. I think it'll be able to keep up for a while uh, before everything implodes. Yeah. Okay. So this bit of road is getting sorted. Uh, I think we're waiting on cranes in most of the places now. Um, where are the... Uh, okay, we got seven workers coming down. Where are you? Ah, you're tootling along a snow-covered road. Yeah, well, that's going to take a moment to get where it's going. Uh, we could just do this. We could even do this. Yeah. Yeah, why don't we ride a uh, bus through the, a winter wonderland here with uh, wires and everything all, all up in our face. Yeah, why not? Let's turn off the uh, interface. I press G, by the way. Yeah. Oh, look, it's an excavator. Oh, look, it's a snowplow. Oh, we can go faster because the road's been plowed. Yay. Oh, it's a blinker that actually blinks. Wow. And over we go. There's the red star. Wild. And we have run out of plowed road. Yeah. You know what? That actually looks... That looks kind of cool set up that way. It kind of does. Okay, let's get out of there. Um, gee. Okay, that's better. Uh, right. So, this is done. Building is without drinking water. Yes, well, it would be. Now, food is more important here. I'm just going to put that up at 50%, right? Yeah. Now, this guy, does it has, yeah, okay, we got cranes coming and all, of, we got a crane coming and all of that jazz. We also have a water truck coming here. And, of course, we don't have any sellers. That is fine. Uh, I don't need sellers just yet. Okay. Well, if I go and look in here. With the building and the route plan. So if we come and look over here. Uh, why don't we ride another truck? Yeah. Okay. Well, bus. Maybe we'll be riding this. Oh, the clouds look kind of cool. Uh, maybe we'll be riding this when uh, the, the melt comes. Yeah, maybe. Probably, actually. It takes forever to get anywhere in these places. Trees. Wires. truck yeah, yeah I, that's pretty obvious I mean truck truck bus yeah yep the melt has come so there we go we're we're heading in a little bit faster ooh that road is uh, wonky that's kind of cool the road is wonky that's kind of cool are you sure that's what you meant to say? No. But it's what I said. Oh, okay. Well, as long as you know that. That was an interesting uh, way 
to come at it. It's a giant red star. And whoosh. Oh, wow. Uh, that has... Uh, get that back. Yeah, close that. Um, right. Well, that's uh, making quick work of that warehouse, isn't it? Right. Good. That's... Uh, Ah, uh, it's, it's going to run out before it finishes, isn't it? It is. Dope. Always with need another couple of bus loads. Yeah, always with that. Okay, well, let's just uh, check in with the uh, labor operation. 92% there. Um, yeah. Oh. Well, some stuff is making some real progress down here. Uh, plumbing is. Yeah. Well, it's because it has mechanisms. Like, if we look at this one. Um, where is this one? Oh, it's right there. Okay. Yeah, it's building the pipe up that way. Right. So it takes a minute to do that, right? Uh, what's this? A new type of vehicle is available. What is it? Um, that's a rail constructor, isn't it? Um, or it's a crane, like it says. Yeah, who knows? Uh, it's a thing. Okay, well... Um, Warehouse. There is a bus going there. Yeah. Um, right. Okay, well, that's getting a whole bunch of stuff sorted out. Right, and this is going to get sorted out real quick. I think it'll be real quick anyway. Uh, we got seven. So if we get a three times improvement, we will finish this on one bus load. Um, would we be so lucky? Yeah, we, we are. Okay, now we're going to go limit amount. Uh, we're going to go no crops, no chemicals, no fabric, no alcohol. Uh, we will allow food, clothes, electron... Nope. Uh, no mechanical components, no plastics. Yeah. And we will allow the meat, of course. Uh, I'm going to bring the food up to 50%-ish, and the other two can be lower. Okay, so that's going to be some extra storage there. Yeah, okay. Now, I need some sort of logistical operation. That would be a distribution office. Um, close that. Uh, that would be a distribution office. Yes, you said that. I did. Uh, where is your distribution office? Nope. Ah, those are the distribution offices. Right. So you need to build one. Oh, yes. Okay, so build one. Well, you're going to have to open the right thing to do that. Yeah, I guess I suppose I am. Where is it? It is... General Cargo. Distribution. Small distribution office? Um, or a medium one? I could build a medium one, but that's huge. You're going to build a medium one, aren't you? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going to. Bam. Okay. 
Well, you're building it. Uh, okay. Nope. Build that. Yep. Okay. Now, where are we going to find gravel? Is gravel coming? Maybe. Um, right. Okay. So stuff is... Oh. Uh, all right. That one's not in the construction labor one. Um, right. Gravel operations. Right. Unfinished road. Prioritize it. Yeah. Okay. So we're prioritizing it. Good. Well, that should allow some stuff to get happening. Oh, get happening. That's good English. Some stuff to get happening. Maybe we should. We maybe we can get get happening to happen, right? Uh, certainly be more useful than, to get, than trying to get fetch to happen. Yes, I know. It's a movie reference. So sue me. I watched the movie. Don't remember much about it except that, but I watched the movie. Right. Okay. Well. Need a mechanism. Or people. Yeah, I need a mechanism. Or people. Uh, we just got a traffic jam at the customs house. That's all. Right. Okay, we have a traffic jam at the customs house. Well, that's okay. Oh, is that the mechanism to finish building? Ah, good. Then I'll be able to build that. Okay. Oh, I should have gone with a small one. I should have. I didn't. Not too late to change it. Yeah, I'm not going to. Really, then? You're not going to? No. Okay. Why not? Because I don't have to. Oh. Okay. So what are you going to do? I am going to just let it build um right okay so all almost all of this stuff is happening okay medium distribution office let's bump that one uh, i want that to finish a little bit faster uh right okay Uh, how's this coming along? Well, we've got 12 tons of gravel in there. Yeah, yeah, like a whole 12 tons of gravel. Um, I think we have all the gravel in there now. Yeah, we have all the gravel, at least. Yeah, all the gravel. Uh, we need concrete. But that's going to take a minute because the uh, trucks are going to be stuck in traffic. Yeah, it's going to be a thing. It's a whole thing, you know. Trucks stuck in traffic, a whole thing. Uh, the the uh, developers have said they like the customs houses set up this way. Uh, now I'm going to just, you know, because uh, stuff is kicking about, I'm going to uh, explain what I think the problem is. I do not think the problem is the custom houses getting busy and having a traffic backup in them. That is not the problem. The problem I have here is uh, f uh, we have if we have a truck going in, we can't have another we have a vehicle and we can't have another one going in at the same time if their path does not conflict. And they it should be able to send. Uh, so if we start here uh, and it starts stacking them up here, 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 here and here in order, 
it should be able to take five of these things. This guy goes in, this guy goes in, this guy goes in, this guy goes in. They should be able to go in all like that. And when they're leaving, they should be able to leave simultaneously even to different road entrances, right? Uh, and that's that's the key. Like it, it wouldn't necessarily improve uh, throughput that much for the most part, but they shouldn't be blocking. Like this guy should be able to move immediately. Uh, and this guy should be able to move immediately. And then these guys coming out should be able to come out and maybe wait here instead of waiting here, right? If they were waiting here, then uh, it'd take them less time to clear, right? And that would that would make a difference. But even more so, if this was connected to multiple roads coming from different directions, uh, it should be able to be serving uh, vehicles uh, coming in on this road and exiting on this road at the same time. And, and that's that's where I think these things, uh, they, they back up a little bit more than they really should. Now, the small customs houses, it's less of an issue. But the big one, uh, it's not handling anywhere near the throughput that I think it should be able to, uh, even without it looking ridiculous with vehicles going through each other, right? So that's, that's just my thought on those. Um, but the developers have uh, indicated that uh, they think it's fine the way it is, and they're not going to change it. Uh, or at least that's the indications. Well, that's the developers. They're the ones developing the game. <coughs> oh, yeah, it's, uh, you don't want them clipping through like that, right? Um, and if we're going to have clipping like that, we might as well... Uh, I'll let them clip in the uh, building, right? Um, right. Why? What? What? What happened to cause that? They, the guy did a passing maneuver, didn't he? Yeah, that's probably what it is. Ah, there we go. It clears. Okay. Right. Now, uh, how is this one? Oh, it's got a mechanism. Need some concrete. And the concrete trucks are over there. Right. So the concrete will happen. And, uh, yeah, that will get sorted out. Oh, meanwhile, I can... Uh, I can uh, replace this name with that. Biological Needs Logistics. Yes, Biological Needs Logistics. It's the needs of the biological creatures. Yeah. Uh, so you're saying that there's non-biological creatures. I'm like, well, there might be. How do you know there isn't? I guess it's a fair question, really. How do we know there, there aren't non-biological uh, creatures? I suppose if uh, uh, you know if we if you could uh, simulate sort of what biochemistry does with electronics, you could get something that resembles a creature, but electronic instead of biochemical. I suppose that could work. You know, realistically, it could work. Uh, oh, it's all it's uh, coming up on twenty percent done. Well. That is making progress. Oh, we got two excavators there now. No, no wonder it's making progress. Okay. So, after it finishes that, I need bricks, boards, and steel. Right. Bricks, boards, and steel won't be too much of a problem. Uh, all of these things are making progress, except for some medium voltage wires. Which ones are those? Those are down there. Those are down there. Yeah. They're down there. Uh, stop saying that. Okay, I'll stop saying that. Biological needs logistics. Where? Okay, yep. Yeah. Now it's going to start uh, delivering other stuff to it. 
Now, why am I watching this? Well, it's just uh, observing the uh, construction uh, order of things. It can be vaguely interesting. You see all these trucks here. They just uh, charged off to collect the stuff needed for the next level. Right. And we're delivering workers before we have the materials needed to use them. That does sound rather Soviet, doesn't it? Yeah, I think it kind of does. That It's annoying, but it's kind of truth in uh, gaming, uh, if you really get down to it. It kind of is, really, when you get down to it. And... Right. Yeah, and we got like one work day in while while that stuff was uh, delivering there, right? Uh, oh, apparently we got cranes arriving as well. That will help. Yeah, that will definitely help. And... Oh, yeah, the work days are going down now. Uh, we just need resources to turn up. Which they will, because they're not that far away. Uh, we need some boards. We need... No, oh, the boards are coming. We definitely need the bricks. All that stuff is coming. Oh, look. One more truckload of steel is required. Yep. And two more of boards, I think. Well, one more, maybe. Yeah, one more. And four, five more of uh, bricks, I guess. Yeah. Well, I think that's a steel going to come. Meanwhile, uh, we have workers uh, toiling away. Yeah. Well, that's 34 bricks remaining. Yeah. Yeah, we don't really need a commentary on uh, the ongoing blow-by-blow -blow of a construction site, do we? No, not so much. And notice this number isn't really changing that much either. Uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's kind of good. That means the construction that's going on is not outpacing the economic activity that we are funding through foreign labor. Right. Right, couple more loads of bricks. Yeah, most of the stuff has arrived. Well, there's one more bit of the bricks is coming. Yeah. And then we'll just be waiting for workers. Yeah, just waiting for workers. And I think that's the last load of bricks. Okay, yeah. We'll just be waiting for a thousand work days to tick down. Yep. So just a thousand work days to take down. Okay. So far so good. Right? Yeah. Now, how is our other stuff coming along here? Got a whole bunch of stuff getting whole bunch of stuff is halfway or more done, actually. Oh, small water well. Oh, it's just, it's waiting still. Okay. Right. Well, we're down under 1,100 workdays on the distribution office. Yeah, so things are happening. Uh, it would be going a little faster if we had less of a traffic jam. Yeah, yeah, it definitely would. Pretty sure it would, anyway. Yeah, pretty sure. Anyway, that will get built, and then I'll sort sort out what to do with it, all of that jazz. Uh, I don't think it'll be too big of a problem figuring it all out. Yeah, basically, I'll be uh, putting some gas in it and some trucks, and uh, some sourcing stuff at customs. 
Uh, ultimately, I'll want to source the stuff at a warehouse, but uh, yeah, I haven't, uh, or a, a loading, unloading station, probably. Uh, a cargo station. That's what it's called. It's called a cargo station. I might want to sort, you know, source things at one of those eventually. But that would just slow things down even more, wouldn't it? Well, now it's going to be under a thousand work days. Yeah. Okay. So that is ticking along. Uh, I really need to get somebody to edit these things. So they put ticking along counters in or something like that. Yeah. Okay. Oh. I might as well assign that now that it can be reached. Yeah. Okay, I think that's most of the infrastructure. Um, no, I haven't built... I haven't queued that or that up. Yeah. Okay. Well, uh, that is going to muddle along for a minute or 12. As you can see, if you take a look in on here. Yeah. Although, uh, biological needs logistics is at 50% done now. So, hey. Uh, a pipe is uh, making some progress too. So that's a bonus. Right. So I think next episode, I think I'll be able to get to the point where I'm actually launching construction on some of these guys. Uh, I think... Uh, I, I don't think I'll be uh, importing people just yet. I think I'll be building the uh, buildings without the import. Uh, do you have to bust the, the people in? Uh, yeah, if you have to bust them in, that'd be different. Uh, yeah, I haven't tried inviting people yet, so I don't know. Right, 55%, yeah. Well, what I'm going to do, uh, this is just going to sit here and tick along and make progress slowly uh, and then make prog a great deal of progress very fast, I'm sure, where a whole bunch of stuff will suddenly finish as the bigger projects uh, work their way through uh, getting completed, right? Anyway, uh, I haven't tanked the Republic yet, and yeah, that's... Kind of surprising, actually. But I haven't tanked it yet. Uh, plenty of time to do so still. But I haven't yet. So anyway, uh, on my way out the door here, I'll just mention that if for some bizarre reason you feel like you want to support the channel, I have a Patreon. Uh, it's there if you want it. If you don't want it, it's still there. Uh, it's not going to harm you any. You can just ignore it then. Yeah. Uh, enough nonsense on that. I guess that's all there is to say, so see you back next time as Biological Needs Logistics passes 60% completed.